What's up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. As you guys can see by the title of today's video, I'll be talking to you guys about how I cleared my dark marks and acne on my face. Now, I'm not saying I have the best skin in the world, but I am saying that I have some tips, tricks, and solutions that may help you out. Um, if this is the first time seeing my face or know my existence, hello, hi, how are you doing? Make sure you guys hit that big red button, subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to hit that bell so you don't miss any more of my future videos. Now, if you have acne and dark marks, stay tuned. Yeah. I try to show you. Now, before I even get into anything, like I said in the beginning of the video, this is the things that I did for my skin. Let me let me repeat. This is what I did for my skin to help me clear my acne and dark marks on my face. Um, the first thing that I did was get a skincare routine. I was washing my face with Dove and I just swore up and down that Dove was like the holy girl for my face. But then I just realized that it was just really drying my face out and just not um, really being helpful for my skin. So the first thing that I would suggest for you to do before you even start anywhere is to learn your skin type. This is going to be helpful for you when you're finding your products for when you're trying to get um, get your skincare routine together. Now that is my second suggestion. But like I said, find out your skin type. I have combination skin. I get really oily at the T-zone and then I have like normal-ish skin here. But um, my main areas is boom, this T-zone area. It gets very, very oily. It gets, you know, that's where I have um, most of my dark marks and just acne, just, it just, yeah. So, um, you may have normal skin or you might have dry skin or you might have normal to dry skin. You know what I'm saying? It just depends. You have to learn your skin type. So then you can go on to my next suggestion is creating a skincare routine. Now, um, I just feel like a simple skincare routine should consist of a cleanser, a toner, not even a toner, a mask. You should get a, a, um, a, <laughs> you should get a facial cleanser, a mask, and a facial moisturizer. That is going to be very, very key for you. And make sure when you're looking for these products, you are catering to your skin type. That is why you should know your skin type before you start getting products. Now, um, the next thing that I did that really, really helped my skin was um, getting a facial moisturizer. I was just using like body lotions and things of that nature on my face and it was just really, really, really making my face oily and having acne and then I was popping pimples and getting dark marks. So yes, um, get a facial moisturizer that is catered to your skin type and that is going to bring me to the next suggestion that I did. Um, years and years ago i mean i still you know uh, uh, but for the most part um i do not pop my pimples that is going to be um very very critical in dark marks in your face popping pimples leave dark marks yeah so stop popping your pimples as much as you may want to pop it and as much as that pus is just right there, ready for you to pop. Just don't pop it. Just wash your face, use your cleanser, use your products, and um, it should just have it go away naturally instead of popping it and leaving a dark mark. Another thing that you should do to um, clear your skin is something that I need to work on myself, do as I say, not as I do, is drink plenty of water. Um, I'm not really a water drinker. Um, I'm very, very picky when it comes to water, but drinking water is going to really, really help your skin. Anybody that does like a facial or anybody that really knows about skin that looks at my skin, the first thing that they say is it needs moisture, like it's dry, like you don't drink enough water. Even though my face is like very oily and it's producing a lot of oil and things of that nature, it's still very dry. So, you know, drink your water. Drink, drink your water. That is going to be one of my goals for this year is to just drink more water. Um, another thing that I would suggest that I do not do, um, but I'm going to start doing, is wearing sunscreen. Wearing sunscreen is very, very important for your skin 
and um, clearing dark marks and preventing dark marks. Yeah, so continue. Just just be on the lookout for like new videos because I'm trying to find a good facial SPF that doesn't leave a white cast. I don't really fuck with the white cast, so um, just stay tuned. I'm, I I think I have one that I um, have been hearing very good things about. I just haven't went to go pick it up yet. But once I do and I test it out, you might just see it featuring here on my channel soon because I'm trying to get more to skincare and let you guys know. You know what I'm saying? Put y'all on. Yeah, so anyway, um, the next thing I did was actually exfoliate my face. <clears throat> now, I purchased myself a facial brush. This is from Vanity Planet. You probably can't tell because it's just lights, camera, action in this bitch. But it says Vanity Planet right here. Now, I just actually currently went on their website and they don't sell this anymore. And I'm very disappointed because a good facial brush, it seems like it's very hard to come by these days. I used to get my facial brushes off of Groupon and they actually used to look just like this. Maybe this was like gray instead of black, just, but it was actually just like this. And then I think maybe like a year ago, I just so happened to go back on Benedict Planet's website and they had this and I just had to get it. Um, I was actually looking for brush hair replacements. I found them on Amazon, but they do not sell this particular face brush anymore on their website. Now, I am not too fond of their other face brush that's very, very popular amongst the, um, the influencers these days that has that silicone um, brush head. They have the right idea. It's just the execution for me the facial brush is weak. Um, I, uh, getting a facial brush from like Target or Walmart, I just feel like it's gonna be weak and it's not going to be a good facial brush. I need like something strong, heavy duty. I don't even know if you can tell on the camera, but this is just like a very good motor. This is a waterproof one and it just really, really, really just gets through the dirt, grime, and oil that's on my face throughout the day. I really, really love this. Um, it's battery operated. Um, Groupon may have them still. Try to find something like this. I might, if I try to, if I find it, I'll link it below or link something similar like this below. But really, really be careful with the face brushes out there because they, they be weak. They be, they be so weak, in my opinion, in my skin. <laughs> Um, but yes, exfoliating is going to really help with acne and clearing dark marks. I clear a lot of my dark marks on my forehead um, through exfoliating. I'm going to insert some pictures of what my acne actually used to look like before I actually really started to um, take the time and the effort to um, better my skin. So yeah, that's what... I was giving and this is just what I'm giving now so you know back to exfoliation do not over exfoliate your skin you're gonna do more harm than good I know you may just get very exfoliation happy when you first get your brush like I was trust me chill you don't need to do it every day chill I over exfoliated like here in this area. It was just very just raw. Just, yeah, it was it, it, it was not the best. And then I actually like damaged my moisture barrier. It was just, do as I say, not as I do. Don't over exfoliate. Don't use scrubs, like body scrubs. I mean, I'm, don't over exfoliate, okay? I think those were like the first few things that I did to just really clear up my skin and I noticed a dramatic difference in my skin. If you are not doing everything that I just told you to do, go back to the drawing board. Don't come into my DMs, ask me you know, skincare questions if you are not doing all of these steps. Okay. <laughs> um. But that is all that I have for you guys today. If you've learned something new and if you're going to take something from this video and actually apply it to your life and try to see results, 
gave this video a thumbs up. It really, really helps me out a lot. Make sure you guys hit the big red button to subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit that bell so you don't miss any more of my future videos. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram at the real Dre Major. And um, I will see you guys in the next one. Stay tuned for more skincare videos coming your way. Deuces.